Hello and welcome. This is Jit Dolakia and you're watching It's Tomorrow News. Flood warnings spread south as three days delayed to smash Britain. Weather warnings have been issued across much of the UK with heavy rain expected to lead to flooding in some parts. After severe flooding struck the Midland and Yorkshire last month, the Environment Agency has now issued more warnings for the south of England. This comes as the Met Office issued widespread warnings for rain extending into the weekend. Depending on how severe the incoming storm is, the low pressure system could be given the name Storm Breddon. The Environment Agency has issued 10 flood warnings, meaning flooding is expected, immediate action required. This covers a widespread area including around the river Seven, which burst its bank in November. An additional 74 flood alerts, meaning flooding is possible, be prepared, have been issued covering much of the UK. The Met Office has issued warnings of ice, rain, fog and wind. The ice warning was in place until 10 am on Wednesday morning. The ice alert stretches from Liverpool across to Lincoln as well as south over the North London and west over Gloucester. The Met Office is warning of injuries from slips and falls on icy surfaces as well as icy patches on some untreated roads, pavement and cycle paths. The rain warnings are widespread and persistent this week, stretching right into Saturday. The rain warnings mostly cover the south and parts of Wales, stretching over Portmouth and Brighton as the week goes on. The Met Office said heavy rain is likely to move eastward across southwest areas later on Wednesday. Some 20 to 30 millimeters of rain could fall in a 6 to 9 hours period, with perhaps as much as 60 millimeters over Dartmoor and the high ground of South Wales. Fog on its smother London and stretch across the UK right up to York. The Met Office warned of some travel delays with a possibility of delays or flight cancellations. The Met Office said strong southeasterly winds are expected to develop during the Wednesday afternoon across parts of southwest England and West Wales before spreading to Northern Ireland and parts of southwest Scotland later. The strongest wind will be for exposed coastal areas and over high ground with a few places seeing gusts reaching 60 to 70 miles per hour. Most inland sites are likely to see wind gusts peak between 45 to 55 miles per hour. Some travel delays are also possible as well as short term loss of power and other services said Met Office. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news, Jeet Dulakia. For more weather updates like this, please subscribe to our channel.